Hey, welcome back. I want to show you how you can add some masking to a video. So super and easy. The first thing you want to do really is get a video. If you have a self-hosted video, you can actually have some uh, like a fallback image. The great thing about that is that if your video doesn't play on a desktop or a mobile, you've got an image so it doesn't lose the effect to what you're doing. However, if you don't want to do that and you're going to get your video from YouTube, please make sure it's a copyright free video or one you already own. Um, but just bear in mind that it might not play on a mobile, so you might have to have a copy of what we're going to do. But you have a responsive mode, so you say on the desktop and tablet, play the video. On the mobile, just show us the image. Okay, so have a think about that. Right, we're going to go over here and we are going to get hold of this video of some lava playing. It's pretty snazzy and we're just going for a particular type of effect. We're going to go to share and I'm going to get the URL for that. Okay, remember though, it's handy if you've got copyright free video because you don't want to be breaching any rules or regulations. Right, we're just going to add it over here, the video like this. And we're in YouTube. Remember what I said? If you had self-hosted, we'd have the facility to add in a poster image. So if the video doesn't play, you've got something to fall back on. Just to show you how this works, I'm just going to go for YouTube for now. And we're going to drop that video in and it should start. Oh, it's dropped down there. There we go. It's, there's your video. We're going to set this to autoplay, preferably play on mobile. If it doesn't, we're going to mute it and we're going to loop it. We're not going to have any player controls present and we're going to have privacy mode as well. Okay. That just means that you can't right click on the video. However, believe me, if you inspect the page, you can still get the URL. Um, we're not going to basically change anything here either. We're just going to let it continuously loop all the way over. So we're just going to update that for now. Now we're going to add the image mask. And this is so simple. It's what you would do to an image or anything else on the website. So we're going to go to advanced. We're going to scroll down to mask. And this is where we now we can pick. So it automatically will go to circle, triangle. There's lots of different shapes here. But we're going to go to custom instead. And we're going to click choose SVG. And we're going to pick an SVG I've already loaded up. You could pick lots of different ones here. Like, look, if I pick this creature design here. But I'm going to go for this blob design here. It's like capsules or pills. You can be quite creative. Words, images, silhouette of an athlete, anything you want to go for, OK? you can do and stick into here. It is so versatile. And that now is a custom bespoke video playing in a mask, which just makes your site stand out a bit more. Now, how did I create these pills? You're probably wondering. Canva, oops, let me just get rid of that. Canva.com. I just got a couple of like a semicircular shapes like that. And I just stitched them together, copied them, enlarged them, shrunk them, whatever. Made sure they are black. It, it's preferable that you have black. If they're not fully black, you'll get a bit of gray which you might want in your design, but if not, make sure they're black. Now, when you have the image in Canva, it is really easy to just go here, pick the setting which says SVG. Don't do that, because if you download as an SVG, it will bring a white solid background and the image masking just won't work. If, however, you've got a photograph and you've used Canva's remove the background facility, you could get away with it. However, if you've got an image, okay, and you've made sure there is no color here, you've hit delete a few times, you're still going to get a solid white background. So this is what you need to do. You need to download it as a PNG. Now, before we do that, I'm going to get rid of this and I'm just going to drop in some text. Okay, so we're going to do something like this now, okay? So we've got the wording. Now, remember, it has got to be pure black. We're then going to download this as a PNG. Now, the key bit, it must be a transparent background. If it is not transparent, this isn't going to work what we're doing. So download as a transparent background. OK, make sure you do that. It takes a couple of seconds to do. Then we're going to go over to this website, png to svgcom The link will be in the description. You can't miss it. You scroll down and you choose the file that we just downloaded. And once it's done that, it will then say, well, how many colors are there? Always drop the colors to one. OK because it's the sharpest image you're going to get. If you have five or six, it's, you're compromising the quality a bit. You generate. Now we have our SVG with a transparent background. Remember, you download that. Go back over to your website and we are now going to replace this with the wording. So let's go to upload, select files. And now we're going to upload our new image. Of course, you will have named them properly and all of that. OK, 
We then bring that in and we insert that. And look, we now have text with a video playing in the background and we haven't added any coding or anything at all, whatnot. So I, mean, I could now go to this section um, and I could say, right, we're gonna give this a background color like so, like that, which you wouldn't really do because it's pure black there. But if you wanted to get a particular effect, this is on the section, by the way, we could do, can be quite creative with your wording and how your website looks. And I think that's a pretty snazzy way of just doing something a little bit different. I hope you like, subscribe, share, and follow. I mean, it's so simple to do, right? Transparent background for your image before you convert to an SVG or use an SVG. You got a video playing. Hey, it makes a difference. You take care. See you soon.